guys are so much easier to kill with archery. Oh, we got one of them things. Welcome back, everybody, to In Shrouded. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to continue on uh, working through these quests. I want to get all of these quests out of the way before we take on new quests from our folks. Uh, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to do a test of skill um, and also a table saw for the carpenter because those are both pretty close to each other. So we'll start with those, and um, let's go to... Um, this flame altar here and pick it up because we no longer need that since we now have the spire itself that we can fast travel to and in this episode also we're going to try out our new um, mace and our new bow upgrade that we got as well so let's pick this thing up first okay so that has been picked up now let's just teleport right on up to the top of this Spire here. And it looks like we want to go this direction. Yeah, pretty much. Um, a test of skill. Let's set that as the waypoint. And we're going to take this and this and this okay let's do this nice okay so we cleared the the shroud there shrouded area that's a big old boulder see a couple I see three poison plants up ahead and something over that way test of skill table saw yeah so pretty much we're on the right track here yeah so this um, bow shoots quite a bit faster than the other one did and I don't think it costs us any stamina at all which is nice so it's definitely an upgrade uh, from those for those reasons nice crit there that's kind of a weird setup these guys have like there's a king plant and then two smaller plants or something I don't know alright it's actually quite nice that um we don't expend any more stamina with this bow. I'm, I'm already seeing the benefit of that. All right, that's something different. So let's not get sidetracked by something different, except for that. Well, let's just uncover it to see if it opens up anything on the map. Lush pasture. Okay. Oh shit. So does that mean there is potentially some crops here? Of course, pasture is really more about, um, you know, livestock than crops. Now there's hazelnuts. Oh shit, man. These poison plants are all over the place. Alright, we'll let it finish uh, engulfing our head here. That's pretty disgusting. Oh no! What? That was weird. I don't know why it said no ammo. 
Okay, well, let's just continue on here. Uh, we discovered the place, so we, at least we uh, know where it is now. Alright, so we've got a cave here with a bunch of these little mana mushroom things. Let's pick those. Cave passage. Hmm. Oh, you know what I'm going to do? Oh, shit. I'm going to be careful of this guy. I gotta get, I gotta get used to the attack timing. Um, do we have a problem? I think he has a problem. Um, let's do this. Look at that light, man! It lasts for five minutes. That's wonderful. Oops. Thought I hit the pick button, but apparently I did not. Um, let's take another one of these just so we're all stamina it up here. And let's get you off the toolbar. Oh, you little bastard. Oops. Wrong toolbar. Yeah, I'm, I'm liking this bow, man. I actually am liking it quite a bit. Take those. Take that. Alright. You know we had to come down here, right? It's just... We gotta do it. What the hell is a plant doing growing on a pile of logs? There's something. Something not right about that. Is there... Is there something more down here? We just came down here to kill the plant and that's it? Hmm. I guess so. Topped off on our health there. Now, um, this stuff here. I think um, if we mine this, I think we get a glowing block. Yes, luminous growth. Cool. Now, if you guys remember, the very first tomb that we went into, where we got the bone blocks, this stuff also appears in the, in the chamber where the coffin is. And you can also mine it there uh, and get the luminous growth. But that could be pretty cool for some, you know, different builds and things. Um, I'm basically talking about... So this is, uh, this is the first spire, this hidden tomb right here. So if you go into that tomb um, and go all the way down into the where the main sarcophagus is on each side of it, You'll find this glowing stuff, and uh, you can get the the luminous growth stuff. So I'm gonna mine this until I have ten, and then we'll continue on. All right, we are out the other side here, and continuing on towards our destination. We sure, are getting a lot of. Poison sacks. Oh, by the way, I still cannot make copper arrows. I know how to make them, but 
I don't know how to make copper bars, which we need first before we can make the arrows. So um, I'm sure that that will come available to us once we finish up the blacksmith's quests or keep working on them anyways. I'm not going to grab any more flax for now. I got quite a bit of that. In fact, I have quite a few strawberries too, come to think of it. Okay, we got something here. Or not. Hmm, that's weird. Okay, let's look at our map. Um, I guess we're closer to here, so let's do this one first. Thornhold. Alright, this is where we're supposed to find the table saw. Oh, man. Maybe I shouldn't have just ran in here willy-nilly. scraps. Hey, cut that out. We need to rebuff. Bad guy in here, let's let him out. Yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Uh, okay, anything in here? It's a bed to sleep on. Fast attack. Hey, we got a level up. Very nice. All right. Let's um, just go back over here for a second and take a look at this. We have two points. Um, I think I want to actually get to Eagle's Bane. So we're going to sit on those two points until we get the next one, and then we're going to grab that. Okay, let's go up here. Bad guy down below. Um, Is this anything over here? No, I guess not. Yeah, we want, don't want to pass up metal. All right, let's go in this room. Silver chest. Masterful mace. Looks like that's all that's in here. There's some metal. Come here, bruh. Oh, shut up. Just let's get to it.
All right, so, um, it just goes out to the backyard. Anything over here besides books? More metal? Lockpicks, those are always good. I don't see anything else down there. Dark AF down here. Let's get this sword out. Nothing there. Hmm. That's it, huh? All right. I guess that's it for this house. Uh, what's over here? Not really much of anything. Oh, look at these guys. Looks like they have poison blades or something. Oh shit, okay. They're tough. Oh shit, they're fast too. Just two metal scraps from him? Hmm. Okay. Oh, jeez. Lucky shot there. Got in the muckety-muck. Oh. Well, look at that. No, cut that out. Loot. Nice. Ten copper arrows. Um, I'm still kind of kind of hang on to them until we get the ability to make them ourselves, and then we'll just start using them as our main arrows. Get that metal. It's getting dark, so what we'll probably do is um, go back into that house and sleep in one of the beds. No! Dark. Yeah. Let's do that. Gotta get to the upstairs to get to the beds. I wonder if the game lets us sleep with enemies nearby. Uh, dude. Get off the bed. There. I'm not sleeping next to a skeleton. That's creepy. Okay. It is once again daytime. Got somebody's attention. He did. Anything in here? These. Oh shit! These tents remind me of. Warcraft, you know, like the, the orc tents in Warcraft. Alright. That'll that'll teach you for cornering me. Not a good idea on your part. in here. Uh, 
Oh man, one of those guys again. These guys are dangerous. Okay, um, so far we have not found a table saw, or more specifically, saw blade, but I guess we're not done yet. Hey, right, cut that out. No ammo? Oh, re really? No ammo at all? Oh, shit, okay. Um, I guess we're going melee then. Didn't realize I had used that many arrows. trouble getting the loot prompt on this. Am I supposed to break it? Mm, I don't know. That might make it so I can't loot it at all. I don't know what else to do, though, because it's not... Um, Yeah, I might have I might have destroyed whatever was in there. I think I did. That sucks. Okay, silver chest. Infernal wand. And equipment repair, that's great. Is this better than this? That's a rare, so it's got one more slot if I ever did decide to upgrade it. So yeah, it's better. Let's salvage that and salvage that. Well, it was nice to get our equipment repaired. I guess we have we've not been in that building yet. Yeah, see, we got the same thing here. I can't... I can't... Oh, there we go. Huh. Guess you have to stand right in the exact spot there. Alright, there's a house down there, another house that way. This is a pretty sizable village compared to what we usually see. Isn't there a, a guy? He's up here. It's grappling hook place up there. Wildwood shortbow. Okay, we'll look at that. It's probably not as good as what we have, but it might be. All right, so we have arsonist bow, power 19. This is 14. And it looks like it would add six more points to it. Bringing it one point above this. And it's a short bow, so it still has all the other stuff. All right, I might 
I might upgrade this when we get back to the base and see if it gives us that extra point. Uh, if I'm reading that correctly. Okay, I think that house there... Oh no, we've already been in that house. So we... Have we covered the whole place? Oh. Damn it, my keys got remapped again. Um, settings. I want crouch to be control. And I don't want control to be evade. Uh, R for delete. Okay. There we go. Um, I was going to see if I could disarm that. All right. I think we've completely cleared this place of enemies. But we haven't found a saw blade. Let's look at the quest. Scavengers are taking their loot away in wagons. The circular saw blades must have been taken to a nearby encampment. Following the road should lead one there. Uh, show on map. Okay, so we gotta we gotta follow the rabbit trail, huh? All right, let's um. I guess I have test of skill as the active, so let's make this the active. And I guess we'll head over that direction. Didn't stay parried for very long though. Or stunned, I should say. This guy's a son of a bitch to kill. Wow. Okay, so we gotta go this way. Um let's replenish our buff foods. Chamomile. Ah, we're going up there where the smoke is. Okay. Ah, man, one of these guys again. Wow. Jeez, they hit hard. Okay. I have to be really careful here. Yeah, he doesn't stay stunned for very long. Shit. Ouchies. guys are a lot easier to take out with uh, range damage than they are with one hit and then get away. Okay, let's get back over here. I'm going to take a bandage really quick and then get out of the way. Need some stamina. Like hit him once and then put the shield up. It's 
like parrying him doesn't do hardly any good at all because he just instantly recovers from it. Whew. Okay, you know what we're going to do is we're going to actually take one of these because it'll help. All right. I suppose I could make some wood arrows. I mean, they're going to suck, but they're better than nothing, right? Um... Now we got bees. Come here. Alright, so for wood arrows, I need twigs. Is there something over here? Dismantle? Books. All right, so it doesn't look to me like twigs are forest beat. Oh, nice. Oh, shit. I'm picking forest beats, but these, these trees are a little bit too large to pick straight up. Look at all the clay. Or no, that's copper, actually. Is there something in here? More metal. <laughs> so that means I guess we're going to have to... Cut some twigs. These trees are actually pretty good for twigs, though, compared to larger trees, which makes sense because they're smaller. But they're a good source of getting twigs quickly. Which is a big deal when you're an archer, I've noticed, because... Seem to have a little bit of trouble, you know, um, getting enough of them to keep in my, keep my arrows going. Man, even if there was like a flint mine to run here, we could at least make flint arrows, but we can't. So let's just make some of these. No slot available in backpack. Let's get rid of this. We don't need that shit. Uh, okay. Crafting. I'm just going to make a whole ship load of. Wooden arrows for now. Uh, let's delete that. We're going to need some room to get the saw. Uh, I'm going to get rid of those. I've got lots of that in this too. Okay, let's get back on track here. Oh, another pig den. I've got tons of this raw game meat now. On song frontier. All right, let's poke our head in here. There's another one of those bastards with the poison blades. Put a crit on him. And even with wooden arrows, I still do quite a bit of damage. That's good to know, because then we can just make them in a pinch. Alright, let's go sneaky sneak here. <laughs> oh shit! Ow, that hurt. Trying to get a better angle so I could get in and shoot that exploding barrel. You know what? I didn't get those two heal orbs because I got out of their distance. There we go. All right, let's see if we can do this one more time, just from a different angle, like from up here. Here we go. Yep, 
He did. All right, there's a guy over that way. I really like the speed of this bow, man. I do, I do. This guy way over there, but that might be out of range for us. Oh, nope. I'm using the second little sight marker there, and that was good. Quite hit that guy. All right. Um, where was that? Oh, it, the whole damn thing blew up. Okay. He knows we're here. Time to buff up again. Yeah, man, wooden arrows don't suck, actually. <laughs> they still pack quite a punch. somebody up there read the tower must reach the sky build higher the tower must reach the zenith and rival the grace of the sun itself matron leandra de manso i procured the finest castle stone find plenty of it behind the tower only the best for matron leandra nice castle stone okay so behind the tower it said no you don't Suck it. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> we almost sucked it too. Pick all this stuff up. All right, so that clears two hills. Go down this way. He did. I see a grappling hook thing and yeah, a bunch of guys over there. They almost look like they might be glitched or something. Yeah, you just stand there and taunt so I can shoot your ass. 15 copper arrows, nice. More copper arrows. How many do we have now? 32. That's a beautiful thing. Let's get rid of that. Almost out of wood arrows because I've been shooting them like crazy. Oh, there's a saw blade. Backpack is full, of course it is. Uh, we don't need this. Awesome! All right, we finally found the circular saw blades. That took a while, but it was definitely worth doing.
Metal Star Mace. Oh, for goodness sakes. Um, let's get rid of that. Let's eat that. Uh, what else do we not? Uh, no, I want to keep. I want to keep the hardwood. We don't really need the water. Let's use that again. Just refresh it. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the water. We could probably get rid of the bones and the normal wood too. But let's hang on to it a little bit longer. Take this. Um, that's just a. That's got a lot of damage, but it's only got one upgrade, so we're just gonna salvage it. only want this. There's a normal chest. Ooh, greater healing potion. Nice. We can actually start making those now. All right, we're probably going to spend the night in this bed. And... I think they said somewhere over here by this tower was the castle blocks. Oh, shit. That's not what I was shooting at. These guys are so much easier to kill with archery. Oh, we got one of them things. Oh, this one calls in ads. Okay. Um, take this really quick. Got it. What'd you drop? An elder's staff. And another scat. Okay, yeah, we need all of that stuff. Uh, is this... This is level 13 with 29 power. Yeah, definitely an upgrade. So let's grab that. We'll salvage this. Um, let's get rid of this wood... Give me the metal scraps, baby. All right. Any chance there's a repair bench around here? Take this. I don't need those other things. So that isn't this the place where they said we could find the castle blocks? Oh no. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh my god, I don't even remember where our last spawn point was. Wow. That sucks. Okay. Oh, back at the spire. Alright, well, I'm gonna go home, get fixed up, and then... Jeez, that's gonna be a long run again. And I'll meet you guys back there to get our stuff and see if we can find those castle blocks. All right, guys. Uh, 
I'm almost back to my bag, uh, but it looks like we have repops in this um, in this town here. I don't know if it's completely uh, repopulated, but I also uh, just got another point. Um, well, looks like looks like I have two points, so we're gonna put this into Eagle's Bane. Damage against flying enemies increased by thirty percent, and that's pretty damn good. Um, I, I'm just not convinced that this I, is going to be all that useful. I mean, I'm sure it is useful in some situations, but increase your movement speed while sneaking. That doesn't suck. Um, more time in the shroud would be nice. Stamina counter for spinning down on dirt roads is reduced. Spinning on stone roads is reduced. <laughs> really? I mean, okay, but kind of sucks that I have to go through that to get to there unless I go all the way around this way um, that all helps with poison resistance that would give us endurance wild animals don't attack more maximum shroud time so I want to get to good metabolism um, and I want to get to rebound Ch uh, 30 percent has to spawn a stamina orb when defeating an enemy with the bow Demic social while climbing is reduced. Increase dexterity attribute. Yeah, see, I want all of that stuff. And dessert stomach, too. So, I guess we... I guess we'll go through here, because if we go here, that's a long ways around, and I don't really care about the wild animals and all that kind of stuff. I mean, it would be nice, but not, in my opinion, critical. And this would be good too, but we could get to that after we we do this. So anyway, okay. Um, is there any way at all I can get over there without having to fight the whole damn town again? Um, probably n not. I mean, we could probably get. I wonder if I'm going to have to fight that boss again too. I bet you I will. If the if the other ones have repopped, then probably the boss has too. All right, well, if that's what we got to do, that's what we got to do. It's more XP and loot and stuff like that for us, so it's not a, a complete waste of time. I'm just going to pick up the saw blade again. I'm assuming the um, you know the first one's in our loot in our bag there, but just in case it isn't. What the hell? All right, whatever. I don't have time for this. Apprentice Wand, 29 damage, 26 damage. Uh, yeah, I think this one is definitely better. All right, here they come. Shit. I mean that very well. Guess who doesn't have their healing potions on their toolbar? I'll take a bandage. Okay. No, 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 no! Oh, damn it! I'll turn the wrong way. Take another bandage and then move. Finally. Those guys are really hard to melee. At least for me they are because I'm com kind of more of a <coughs> arranged build. OK, 
quick. No. There we go. Didn't quite kill her, but that did. Whew. Okay. Guillotine. Probably a two-hander. Yeah, it is, but man, it's wicked. Okay. 43 damage, level 13. Um, let's just stick that down there for now. Okay. Now. Let's get our stuff first. Yeah, oh, it's, yeah, it's right by where the explosion thingy is. Hmm. I don't think the explosion thingy will blow it up. And you know, the other thing that just occurred to me, I, I'm going to need some room for this stuff. Or I'm not going to be able to loot it all. All right. We don't need that. We don't need that. Whew. Okay. We do have two saw blades. Oh, man. That was a, that was quite a fight to have to go through and get all that stuff back. Oh, let's definitely get the scrap metal here. Don't really care a whole lot about the rest of that stuff. So, we still need to try and find these castle Castle blocks. Thought they said it was like at the base of the tower. Let's go up here. Oh, well, I wonder if it's in this chest here. Yep, there we go. Nice. City wall block. Very cool. Very cool indeed. Might as well go up to the top of the tower. Probably a gold chest up here. Aha! Uh -huh. Look at that. Ring of mana. Completely worthless to me. You know how many rings of mana I have sitting in the chest back at the base? <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I think that's going to wrap up this episode here. I'm going to spend some time here in the forest. And I mean, I'm also going to go back to the spire too. Um, Because I've broken a couple of jars of the, you know, the, the pots there. And they're dropping copper bars. So I'm going to go through and clear all that out. I'm going to farm up a whole bunch of twigs and just, you know, do some grinding here in the forest. And then when we come back in the next episode, we'll hit test of skill and then go from there so thanks everybody for watching hope you guys enjoyed and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment share the video we'll catch you in the next one bye, -bye.